We know pregnant women are more likely to suffer from severe COVID complications. Well, now a new study is revealing just how devastating the coronavirus can be for an unborn baby. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge is here to explain what researchers found. Hi, Doc. Hey, Kim and Devin. Yeah, you know, there are several different ways that the virus can negatively impact a pregnancy. This research found in rare cases, it's damage to the mother's placenta that leads to a stillbirth. So in the initial first year of COVID, things were um, questionable as to what kind of impact it was having on pregnancy. And we had some data that suggested it was affecting pregnancy outcomes. It later became clear just how dangerous COVID was for unvaccinated pregnant women. The most severe effects we saw with the Delta wave, so not really until the second year of the pandemic, did we see the, um, the most really tragic outcomes with COVID and pregnancy. Cleveland Clinic Dr. Amy McKenney is one of the authors of the study. She says they are not sure why the Delta variant seemed to be the most severe. They suspect the high levels of virus in the mother's blood made it more likely to infect and damage the placenta in some women. Sadly, there is no way to repair the placenta in that situation. The only option is to deliver early, if the fetus is old enough. McKenney says, given all the unknowns of this virus and the complications it can cause, it's vital for pregnant women to get vaccinated. I can say that we have never seen these complications in a fully vaccinated woman. These have only occurred in women who are unvaccinated. The severe complications, meaning the virus infects the placenta and it causes the baby to die in utero or after delivery. Now, Dr. McKenney says it's difficult to get an exact number on how many pregnant women have suffered stillbirths due to COVID since that information isn't kept in any kind of database and some hospitals just don't have the resources available to test the placenta. Yeah. Well, Frank, pregnant women obviously worried about what they put in their bodies. Is there any concern about the risks from the vaccine itself? No, in fact, the research has really become very clear that the risk from the virus itself far, far outweighs any potential risk from the vaccine. Mm -hmm. All of the major obstetric organizations strongly recommend the vaccine for those who are pregnant or planning to become pregnant. Okay. Dr. McGeorge, we appreciate it.